Hey folks, it's John P. from Geeky TV, and we are here at CES 2012. We're at the Boxy booth, and we're about to learn about live TV on a Boxy. Our 2012 CES coverage is powered by Ford. Hey Andrew, thanks for having us over to the booth. I am definitely psyched about learning how to get TV on my Boxy. Yeah, so it's, a, it's kind of a strange idea that we started off as, a, as an internet box and a, and a way to play your local files, and now we've shifted and we're adding live TV. And it's all through this little uh, live TV tuner that we've put out. A dongle. Well, I tell you what, you know, I love Boxy, and what, uh, what's great about it is I get all my online content that way, including Revision 3, Geek Beats on Revision 3, right? Of course. Um, but the, the, the challenge is when you want to watch normal TV, you got to switch back over to another input. So that's what this is for, right? Yep. This is all about all the stuff that hasn't made it to the internet yet. So, you know, whether it's sports on the weekend or news in the mornings and evenings or maybe the Grammys, the Oscars, the Super Bowl, trying to get all that extra content that you can only find on broadcast television onto your boxy box. Okay, so you've got a dongle in your hand. What are we going to do with it? How does this work? <laughs> all right, so let me grab, I'm actually going to grab this box over here. And we'll quickly show you. All we're going to do is plug the box, uh, sorry, the, the USB TV tuner into that port, and you're going to connect this. It can go either to an HD antenna or it can go into the wall port of your cable out box. Uh, not your cable box, okay. but the actual wall port that's coming out of your, uh, or the coax port coming out of your so wall. So the, the, basically the analog feed coming straight out of my wall for, for my uh, cable prior to going into a box that would take it to digital or something. Exactly. So we're not able to get like the HBOs and the Showtimes and the you know other uh, encrypted channels, but for all your ABC, NBC, Fox, CBS, and a lot of other stations that actually come out unencrypted from that signal, we can capture it and put it onto your screen through Boxy. Okay, nice. So that would basically be all the extended cable and all the basic cable and then over the air and all that stuff. Well, that's all I have anyway because we don't really get the, the movie channels and stuff. So uh, we plug that in, we plug in the coax, and then we're done? What's What else? And then you're, you're basically all set. At that point, we'll ask you what your area code is. Oh, sorry, what your, uh, your zip code mm -hmm. is. So we can figure out where you are and what's, what your TV listing should be. And then we'll go through and we'll scan uh, and figure out you know, what the channels are that are available in your area. And then once we're done, we're going to kick you right into live TV. And where did, the, where did the Fox News, I mean, where did it get the labels and stuff from? So because we, um, because we know where you are, we can actually go out and we license that metadata from a company called Tribune. And so now you can see what's on, what, chan what channel it is, uh, how long it's on. You can get more information about it. Um, and one of the cool things, you can't see it here right now because I'm one of the only people here in, in Vegas with live TV, but it will also show you which one of your friends is watching specific shows, if your friend's on Facebook, and it'll also show you how many other people are watching that specific show. So it's a great way to kind of figure out, hey, that looks interesting, I want to tune into that versus all the others that maybe no one else is watching. Interesting, so you're saying if I was watching the eight news now, that I'd see down here like 367 people are currently watching and your friends are these people and they're watching too. Exactly, you see your friend's Facebook profile icons on your channel listing right here. That's very, very cool. All right, well, all right, the big question is, how much is this thing going to run us? So it'll be uh, 49 bucks. It's available for pre-order right now at Boxy.tv, and then it'll ship. Uh, we're aiming for the third week in January, so not too far off. Not too, not too much of a wait. Well, Callie will be happy to hear that, too. Uh, thanks for spending the time with us. You guys keep sticking around. More continuing coverage from CES at geekbeat.tv forward slash CES 2012. Take care. Everyone hates parallel parking, right? But when you use the Ford Focus Active Park Assist, its ultrasonic sensors will find just the right spot and takes the stress out of parking the car. Woohoo! Pair the Active Park Assist with a rear view camera and the car practically parks itself. Thanks so much to Ford for powering our CES coverage.